All right, and welcome back to Cardia, World, the word of fate. Uh, we're going to be continuing with Lacrima's story. Um, this is going to be episode four, aka Lacrima chapter two. This was published by the encryptors in Idaris, but how did it end up here? I can find the culprit by checking the visitor's log at the inn. Who else would use Cardia from a different country? Father, I'll be going. The rich are not necessarily rich in their spirit. People filled with good spirit are not necessarily rich. Therefore, there are a few people who want to volunteer for vigilance. So, I teach the kids in town. When your parents ask you what you want to become, you say you want to become an encryptor. And when the bishop asks you the same question, you say that you want to become a shrine warrior. However, I am very disappointed with the freshman. I don't know what kind of life he had in Vesta. He can't even read a beginner-level Cardia text in this era. What, is he brain dead or something? And why am I the one who has to teach them? This is a drag. Vigilance doesn't pay overtime. And this is why Troy is the best character. Because he's, he's very wise. <laughs> you tell the bishop you want to be a shrine warrior. You tell your parents you want to be an encryptor. Get that money. Um, yeah, but you hope that maybe they want to volunteer and help society. <laughs> but that's not really how things work. <laughs> um, usually we tell the kids to study and help prepare for the festival. Since there are no doctors, Lacrima and I handle the medical work. So we do everything. When something breaks, we fix it. We're a free public service. That's great! Are you stupid? What? Every time we do something, we lose money. That's how it works. You can't expect to get paid. Then why did you join Vigilance? For the Cardia license, kid. That's all. Cardia license? You need to be qualified to use powerful Cardia. Since I have an encryptor's license, I can create phantoms. I see. But why do you need to be a member? The license I want requires me to work for Vigilance or the Knights, so that's why I'm stuck here. I see. All this time I thought you were a good person. In other words, you're a hypocrite. And you're a good kid who lies. We're the same. What? So, anyway, Vigilance is basically charity. So, that's a bad follow-up. Will you stop? Okay. Anyway, there's not much I can do since I'm only good with a sword. There are other things we do, such as holding prisoners, killing wild phantoms and such. Like yesterday's incident? Since the knights are up north, we have to take over. The Crossland Knights are up north. A rebellion occurred in Nordia. It's serious. The knights are there to take care of them? The rebels started to affect our country as well. Are we gonna have a war? Maybe. But since the allied forces are there, it might end. So we don't have to worry about any rebels in town? For the enemy, this is the best time to attack us. It's time for us to work. It will be busy. Is Troy here? I'm Troy, and why do you ask? We're here to arrest you on suspicion of theft. You have the right to remain silent. It's already busy. No, not Troy. Truth and lies.
How many times do I have to tell you? I entered here to pick up something for my professor. I didn't steal anything. The professor doesn't remember asking you anything. He's just saying that to save his own butt. I heard the story. What was stolen? I can't tell you. As of now, only the thief and I know what was stolen. When was it stolen? I saw it yesterday, but it was missing this morning, and it was between yesterday and today. Troy was the only one who entered during that time? There are two encryptors on guard every day. Those two witnessed everything. Troy knows that cardio-related crimes are serious. I wonder if my research will come in handy. Troy, did you really do it? Shut up, stupid! We have no intention of releasing this to the public. Lacrima, can you take care of business in private? What do you have in mind? If he returns the thing he stole, we will not prosecute him. We will allow you to judge him. In this way, the trust towards vigilance will be protected, but Lacrima won't do it. Troy will only lose his license, that's all. May I ask the two encryptors questions? Troy was the only one who entered the library? Yeah, he was the only one. I let him in. And what time was that? It was around this morning. There was a commotion at the pub yesterday. Where were you then? Here, of course. Don't lie to me. I have already witnesses who saw you there. I did go to the pub to see what was going on, but he was here while I was gone. Then he can be in the library while you're gone. W wait a minute. Am I a suspect? I found an interesting thing at the pub. A cardia? This cardia is used to create phantoms. Only certain people are able to use this cardia. I understand, but what does this have to do with the theft? This cardia was issued by the Kingdom of Idaris. I checked the visitor's log and found that one person from Idaris has been here. I was sent here by the Idaris Encryptor School. What does that have to do with anything? So, he could set up the phantoms and go to the school. Once everything was started, one will stay while the other stole the thing. Is this true? No way! Sir, he's the thief. Where's the proof that I stole the text? Oops, you're busted. What? So, the thing that was stolen was text? Bad, I'm bad at this thieving thing. How did you know? You must be the one! Damn, it's almost like... Uh... Oh, I'll just kill you. No! What the... If there's no thief, there's no crime. What a loser. Back off, Kraus. Too bad we can't use fire, Cardia. Why not? Think, Kuhn. Think. It will burn the other texts. That's right. All text is made out of paper. This will be tricky. Oh, Kuhn. But, um, we're going to go against Troy's recommendation to not use fire, and use fire as much as we want. We actually do not get punished for using fire. And there is something that we really desperately do want. And that would be to move Troy. Let's see, where? Where do we want to move Troy? Here? I think? Can we move Lacrima? Let's move this guy. So let's go ahead and go to map confirmation. So there's a couple chests down here. Those will be for uh, Pasha to get. She can stay out of the way. There's a cow. A couple miles. Uh, we have our first bee heads in this chapter. A couple guys here and this evil, evil cow. Evil. Um, there's also two treasure boxes. So, 
this cow will open these treasure boxes and steal them. So we have to stop that somehow. There's also a treasure box over there, but that's fine. Treasure box here, that's fine. It's really just that cow that we're worried about. So in order to make sure that we can get the cow, um, we're going to have to be very careful with our first moves. Troy can create another phantom here. Um, let's see, we have two shadows, a common, a doll, and a cow. Or a Q? I'm not sure what it's... I think... Yeah, cow. Alright. Um, I guess we'll create a doll. No, let's create a... Let's create a common. We'll make it fast, and we'll make it stony. No. Hard? No. Let's make it sharp. Sure. I uh, can't easily climb up this thing. So I guess we'll just, um, I don't know, stick it over here or something. That's fine. Now, we could create some weapons. Which I might just take a look and remind ourselves what sort of weapons we can create. But I'm not seeing any uh, anything we really want to do. He's fine. This thing has... Uh, we can't see its move speed, but it can move pretty fast. Her equipment's more or less fine. His equipment's fine. And we have Pasha. Alright. Pasha, we're just going to uh, move her, actually. It's just... Sure. She can just be down there. That's fine. Let's go ahead and begin the battle. So compared to Tox's story, we have a lot fewer phantoms uh, in this mode, and that's okay. Now we really, really want to get up here as fast as we can. Um, I believe that this cow is going to open up one of these chests, and there's nothing we can do about that. But the other chest we're going to be able to save. Let's go ahead and open this. We got a silver spear. Let's see. Let's actually get Lacrima. Or here we go. Let's get Kuhn. So one thing he can do is he can cast Earth Magic and roll it like a boulder towards this enemy. And then we can get him. He can do the same thing. I know this is like a very weird thing that we can do, but this is gonna be pretty good. And there we go. We got a chain jacket. Uh, I guess that's cool. So do some of these units actually carry stuff? Yeah, he's got a stone knife. This is fine. I mean, we'll be killing all of those anyway. But that's 
That is the evil Kiao. Uh, that is a lot of damage that he can take. Mythocardia, World Cardia. Okay. Not too bad. Uh, we'll go ahead and move the Kiao over here. And let's go ahead and see what happens. He scared me when he went over to that treasure chest. And these bee heads are in the way. That could be bad. That could mean that we need to use some advanced tactics here. Let's see. Let's burn down some bookshelves. This is, uh, I don't know if this is going to work. Did we do this wrong? I think we did it wrong. Because I don't see how I'm going to get over to that thing fast enough. This is absolutely impossible to reach that spot. That makes me want to restart. Uh, let's retry. And let's try um, Phantom Creation. Position. Let's try this again. Maybe uh, Troy needs to be a little bit closer. Crime, it was fine. Here we go. Let's get all of these people over here. Get the cow in place. Okay. Now we're ready, let's go ahead and begin. 
So I actually don't know how resetting will affect the randomizer. So let's go ahead and open this box and see what happens. Silver Spear. Okay, so I think it's... I think it's still the same. So that's good. Helmet Rock. Let's just try to push through. Yeah, so this, this is like the hardest to get item in the game, probably. And we want it. Uh, normally, it would be full of awesome, cool treasure. Uh, in this case, we don't know what's going to be in there. Because it is a randomizer. Oof, so close. What? It missed? It's got one HP. Oh well. It's how it is sometimes. Alright, so this Kiao, he's gonna be a little bit in danger, but he's sort of the backup plan. In case I, for some reason, I can't get my uh, people in position. The cow gives me another shot. I don't really care about these Shadow Miles. They're easy enough to produce. Give this another try. That's Zakuro, the evil, evil thief. For some reason, those units didn't move this time. I don't know why that is. that guy, but uh, whatever. It's fine. So Troy can reach it. Because he can come all the way over here. And cast a stone. No, wait. Can he? Alright, I need Lacrima. Um, how, does, how is this supposed to work? Lacrima has to come up here. and cast a flame on these bookshelves to burn them down. Uh, 
And then Troy can finally leisurely scroll, stroll up here and cast a rock and bust open this treasure chest. Which gave me an ogre jacket. Oh, that's pretty lame. What even is an ogre jacket? Oh, yeah, ogre jacket. Eh, not good. Oh well, you know, sometimes you gotta make sure you open those treasure chests. You never know what's gonna be inside. All right, Pasha, go ahead and open it up. Silk Cardia times five. All right, so we got Doll, and we have Common. Kuhn might not be the best at magic, but... He can still do area of effect attacks, and he might as well. Okay. I feel like I'm going to lose my dolls. But I guess I just have to deal with it. When Troy has a free moment, he can just summon more. Now I think there's just the one treasure chest in the corner where Zakuro was standing. And then we just have to kill Zakuro, I think. I'm not even sure if we have to kill everything else. Probably still will. Uh, but we don't have to. And there's that evil Kiao. He's going for the chest. I can see him. Just has evil in its eyes. Alright, let's see if he can cast a spell here. Actually, no. Can Lacrima do it? That would be better. Yeah, let's just have her use a spell to open this up. Um, yeah, it says there will be no effect, but if we roll it, it does open the box. I don't know why that is. It, there's no hint that rolling a rock at a chest opens it, but there you go. 10 world card, yeah. Okay. Now we're ready to just cause havoc. This 
guy's weak against fire and earth. Uh, he's most weak against earth. I feel like I want to try to save the Kiao, but honestly, it's probably not worth it. Instead, so let's go ahead and make a Shadow Miles. Pasha, it's your time to shine. So yeah, getting that treasure, you have to ignore all these enemies and just run as fast as you can. So we've lost a lot of units here, but it doesn't really matter. At most, we're losing some experience points by letting them die but all of these units would be obsoleted eventually. Um, and we can even check, like, what is the victory condition? Does it tell me? Um, maybe it doesn't list it somewhere. Uh, regardless, I guess we'll go here. I guess that thing is maybe resistant to earth. Oh well. <laughs> this thing is gonna die. All right. Gonna lose like my whole army here. That's the other reason that melee attacks are not that great, is they do get a counterattack. Uh, 
Um, sure. Let's make another thing. Let's go ahead and make a doll, Miles. No, don't hurt Troy. He's too good. Oh, he almost made it out. Poor Shadow Miles. Yeah, so you can go over here and only deal 14. That's so bad. Alright, magic it is. This is the other reason Kuhn is not very good. Like, yes, you can have some better equipment, but it's still just not uh, as good as magic most of the time. Alright, Posh is finally going to get some experience points. Uh, yeah, let's just keep, keep building stuff. I always thought the bee heads were a kind of interesting design. You know, the miles, they sort of look like weird goblins. Um, you've got... Uh, there's, there's a theme, essentially, to the way these guys work. So all dolls will be kind of spiky. Shadows tend to have one eye, and commons, I don't know, look the most like a person. Um, so common bee head just has no head. Whereas I think we saw the shadow, the shadow bee head looked more like this guy without a neck, like his head was part of his body. We'll see the doll um, later on. Let's just take care of this guy. I think we don't have to kill everything. I think we just have to kill him.
Here, even Pasha can get in on this. Pasha, you're gonna get a kill. Getting a kill is one of the ways you can get a little bit more experience points than normal, so... Being able to have a weak character get kills sometimes will help them, you know, stay equivalent levels. What are you gonna do with me? You violated the law. You'll be judged accordingly. You're gonna regret this. You're the one who's gonna regret this. I will hand him over to the chairman. You two can go back. Okay. And we get our stage clear. Um, yeah, we lost six units, but that's fine. Pick up a whole bunch of stuff and a new text. So even though the, we are running the randomizer, there are certain texts that you will get in chapters that are not randomized. And that's just because I couldn't figure out how to do it. I'm back. Hi, Lacrima. Did he confess anything? Nothing. He's just in jail until the knight's return. How bad is it to steal text? Punishable by death. He's gonna be executed. That's far too harsh for theft. You don't know the value of Cardia. How pathetic. Excuse me for not being raised in a barn. A crime How did you know it wasn't him? I just made a guess. Troy is very cautious about these things. If Troy did steal it, what would you have done? I would have killed him on sight. Good night, everyone. That was harsh. Especially when she says that with a serious look. She's different. I told you, she's a genius. That's right, she is different. The stolen text is back. I guess we have a happy ending. Can I ask you something? What is it? Can you swear to me that you're innocent? You're the one who proved me innocent! I want to hear it from your mouth. I will tell you something. Sometimes I say stupid things, but I never lied to you. Alright. I wanted to make sure. Thanks, Troy. Troy, are you listening? Sorry, what was that again? The crime is qualified to create phantoms, but she doesn't. Why? She's a trying warrior. That's what Pasha said, but I don't understand. Let me educate you. Pentagram forbids shrine warriors from creating living beings using Cardia. I see. Living beings created by Cardia are considered heathen, but they're the guardian of the world tree, and that's why they have the license. That doesn't make sense. You have the power, but you can't use it? That's what religion is. Lacrima is very religious. Even in extreme danger, I doubt she'd use her power. Is that how you talk about the person who saved you? She saved me because of my license. Vigilance needs me. I don't agree with you. Yeah. That's right. Lacrima is not like that. She's a very kind person. That's just the way I feel. I don't care if you agree or not. Then I won't agree. Neither will I. Cardia still is great value, even Mithril and Silk. What's your point? Use your brain. Don't waste the card. Vigilance's costs are covered by the pentagram. What do you mean? Why are you saying that? Troy hates me. I'm a burden to Lacrima. Maybe I should quit Vigilance. Poor Pasha. She's she's such a uh, such a gentle soul. <laughs> she needs a lot of help. <laughs> well, that's all that we have for this chapter. So uh, let's go ahead and save, and um, I will 
return next time, we'll switch back over to Toxa's story. See what's going on with him, um, with Mona and, uh, and the gang. So I'll see you then.